All right, so this is just me venting for a second, but anytime I try to give relationship advice, even if I say in the video, relationships are built on mutual respect and trust and both people putting in the work, I always have a handful of people in the comments say, yeah, but this won't work on narcissists. Uh, no, it won't because no advice works on narcissists. Remember, you don't need advice when you already know everything. Shouldn't we instead just say that narcissism doesn't work with relationships in general? Because intimacy won't be possible with someone who only thinks about themselves. Connection can't exist when someone is trying to control or coerce you. Mutual respect will never be felt when one person has decided they hold all the power and they're the judge of whether your feelings are right or wrong. Closeness can never be cultivated when someone consistently lies or blames you for everything that's wrong in their life. To be honest, I'm not really interested in giving them advice. I'm much more interested in making sure you understand it's not okay for someone to demean or belittle you. I'm far more concerned with you knowing how valuable you are and how much you deserve respect and kindness. I'm more interested in reminding you that you're not crazy and you're not too needy for wanting the bare minimum levels of human decency. And we can have empathy for their traumatic past, but we cannot keep abandoning ourselves to keep the peace in this relationship. We can't continue walking on eggshells or placing our self-worth and value based off their view of us. And I'm just reminding you that the right person for you won't make you feel confused all the time. They won't try to convince you that you're the problem, and if you left them, nobody would ever want you. The right person isn't perfect, but they still want you to feel safe and respected and cared for. The right person's gonna make mistakes, but they care about how their actions impact you. And they have remorse, and they want to repair any disconnection or hurt that they may have unintentionally caused, even if they're a work in progress, like we all are. And maybe it's not the narcissists that need to hear that advice. Maybe it's us.